Hello guys, how are you doing today? Uh, we're going to be checking out a game called Kingdom Castles. It's in an early alpha build, it's pretty unstable, uh, but it's a pretty fun game. So yeah, I haven't played it much, so we'll be checking it out. Uh, if you guys want to check out the new alpha build, go into the Steam page, right click on the game, select properties, and in the beta tests, which is not in beta, but you get the picture, put in alpha tester 123. That's all one word, no caps, alpha tester 123. Alright, so without further ado, let's get into this. New. Uh, we're gonna go on easy mode, because I'm not that great. Pick this flag, looks pretty good, you know. This is a fish fill. Clearly. So, let's generate a, a large map, because those are pretty fun. Oh, this one looks pretty good. Mm. You know what? We can go, because... You know what, I think I want to start on this island in this map. I don't know. Yeah, sure, I'll shoot I'll I'll do this map. This is a lot of good fishing. So then we'll add rivals, Mikey's world. You can get isolated over here, Mikey. You'll be no uh you'll be normal. No, 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 that's not right there. You're going on this other little isolated island. Alright, yeah, so that one's too big. So, yeah, these will be two little kingdoms. They're going to be on small islands because I'm not very good at the game, frankly. And any kind of real competition would uh, kill me. So, we're going to put ourselves right here. It's a pretty good position. We've got stone, we've got iron, we've got everything we would need. Let's get the game and watch them go. So, uh, in case you haven't already figured out by what you've seen, this game is pretty damn simple. You have a small little village and you manage it. Or, I, uh, I should say, not village, rather, because, you know, you'll develop rather quickly, actually. And before you know it, you'll be go from a sle sleepy little hamlet to a huge kingdom. But, uh, like I said, not very good, so <laughs> I stunted my enemy AI by giving them horrible islands. So let's build a hope. Actually, let's build a road first. And then we'll build a, a few homes for our people. Uh, this looks like some nice, just clear, not very useful land, so we'll just build it there. And then these houses the people will build it and uh boom one house and let's do a second house so we're gonna definitely want to start processing this stone over here which is gonna be an incredibly vital resource for us the quarry will help us with that and we'll build our roads over to there and there we go so people are the main concern without people you're gonna Obviously, you have unfulfilled jobs and a lot of bad things, but food is also rather difficult to obtain. So it's it's like you gotta have a nice little balance of enough people to sustain your empire. I should say maybe you know call it whatever you want, but then you don't want to have too many people because then you won't be able to feed them. There'll be food crises. Overall, that's not a good thing to have happening to you. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna try and expand. I I think this river over here will make a nice little harbor kind of thing. Let's see, maritime, ooh, piers, merchant ships, all sorts of good things. I think first thing though would be to build a bridge here, just to allow us access to these fertile resources, good fishing at like this head of this bay. I, sh I shouldn't say head, but rather near the mouth. Um. Why, what aren't we getting things for? Oh, we're going to need quarry workers higher up in the list. Like I said, people. We need people right now. Um, everything is very expensive, so. There are no timber workers? Wow. Maybe not quite so many farmers, because, you know, everything is important right now. You can't really prioritize one thing. There we go. Now we're going to be earning some timber, some stone. This is a large array of resources to help us build our nation. Um, 
and I'll be making this into a series, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Similar to the other video, which uh, I will be putting out another City Skylines video soon. So, maybe even later today if I'm feeling up to it. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed these two games. Um, we're definitely going to need more people, like I said. So, perhaps it'd be beneficial just to save up for a cottage. Because, I mean, that seems like a pretty... But it seems like it would be pretty good because it'll give us a lot of homes and like I suspected they're better I guess space management than the other things what is huh what are we not earning this stone for oh fire how do I get how do I treat this what how do I leave this issue perhaps a well well maybe it'll help See what I did there? Hmm? I'm sorry, that was pretty horrible. Um, well, we're gonna keep it slow because I don't want things to spiral out of control too fast. What are my advisors thinking? Life better? Food? Okay, food, like they're saying, is a big issue, so. We're gonna go with another orchard. Orchard. God, did I say orchard? Because. Or have we're not getting enough fruits, frankly. Four new residents, that's pretty good, I gotta say. I'll work on mm, I'm good actually. Don't want to overpopulate it. Well, you know what? Mm, I have a, actually a forester would not be a terrible idea. I can't think I was in some mode. It's the winter. Let's see, there we go. Wow, population steadily rising. So I don't feel guilty building that house there. Oh, four new people. Goodness. Population. Boom. Uh, food supply? Yeah. I realized that as well. We're gonna need wood and stone. That's the main thing for us. Right now we've got every job fulfilled and no idle workers. That's pretty good. I think either a cottage or well let's see. It, you know, we'll s uh, that's I guess a cottage will help us in the long run. So we'll put down one of those. We'll bring back quarry workers to full production priority. Oh, yeah, so a small village. That's not bad, not bad. Five new residents, that's good. I think I'm going to want to move to a tavern soon to help increase people's happiness, because as long as they're willing to work... Oh, dragon attack, uh-oh. Why didn't I get forewarning of this? <laughs> that's not good. Well, we can build another quarry. And then maybe another farm. But there's no fertile land readily available. I guess this will have to do. See, I don't want to stretch my resources too thin. Dragon sighted? Where is this little land? Oh, I see the mini map. Oh, I can move the mini map around. That's kind of cool. And I presume, yep, close and open it. Three new people. Skyrocketing, pop skyrocketing population. We've done something right if everyone's want to move here. Well, let's build a... Maybe a charcoal maker. Cause I'm sure charcoal has a use. Yeah, it says it's used in homes. Oh, wait. Can I build the treasure room yet? Very close. Ten more stone and we'll be good. F Jeez. Farmers are low right now. We need people to make food. Our growing nation, one could say. Uh, so, and they're <laughs> little square people hard at work. Four new residents. Oh, I'm glad the happiness is so high. I'm sure they're not going to be happy when I tax them, though. Mm, taxes. Nice ASMR. And <laughs> or ear rape, whatever you want to call it. 
and I will be streaming soon too, so if you guys want to see streams or such, I will be doing that. What is... Rock removal? Hmm. I am on. I might want that, because that'll help me. Again, like, so that in the long run, I assume. Four new residents. Population just steadily rising. A second cottage. To give headway for more people to move in. I, it might actually... There are five new people, not four. I was wrong. I, I over misspoke too soon. Well, that's not good. Maybe not that much taxes. Not that much taxes. No, guys, calm down. <laughs> Oops, I made a made a little mistake there. Overtaxing them, I suppose. Well, now I can build things. What are these? Hmm. Well, what do we want to save for? Because I think we need more people, that's for certain. But, well, population is steadily increasing still. Um, maybe a baker. That's like a relatively cheap structure. Fish or pork is definitely in deficit. But we have good fishing lands here, so... Should not be a problem for terribly much longer. I at least presume. We need wood. I guess a little bit more clear cutting cannot hurt. But I don't want to get rid of all of it because, you know, renewable resources and such. So maybe we'll put a little bit of people to that. Hey, there we go. Fishing cut cuts a lot of wood. Wood is seeming to be like a large stipulant for not, not being able to build stuff right now. Not a forester. A fisherman. Fishing hut. That looks like it'll get good coverage for us. Good feelings about this. I should bring up our food. Then we can also expand and build houses down here. A tavern. That'll definitely boost our happiness. Maybe I'll build a second road through. This is kind of in a bad place. I'm going to replace that right here. We're going to build another road. And then that's good. People are toiling away. Oh, fire. Come on. Don't do me like that. Oh, and, and the baker, too. Tax collectors are not doing their job, right? I bumped it up. <gasps> oh, they're depressed. No, don't wait. No, no, don't do it. What's our house looking like? We got good amounts of everything but fish and pork. I mean, makes sense. I'm not making much of that, but... Maybe... I'm out of wood again. That's not good. to start dipping into secondary resources over here. But it's a little risky because these wolves, they're pretty protective of their land. So I'm going to try and build a second forester. Perhaps right here. Kind of monopolizing that small little piece of land right there. Because, you know, every bit of wood surely will help, so... Um... A windmill. Let's see. We need... Oh, okay. We don't need wheat to bread, really. So, um... What do I want to save for? None can find a home. That's what I'm going to save for. 50 wood, and I can build a manor. For 25 people? Wow, I'll be rolling in people now. 
There's maybe a few more woods. I know I'm starting to get a little risky here getting all the wood, but I really, really desperately need it. Alright, this should be a preferable location for a house. I mean, yeah, it's close enough to the rest of the homes to where I don't feel like it's going to be like too far away or anything, so... We're constantly making wood from here and now from here, so that's good. I'll build a stockpile as well, so that should probably help us. Not a big one, you know, just a small little one to help us. But in theory, the stockpile should be able to get help from the forester hunt and uh, just overall be pretty good for us. Don't want to overfish the region, but... Happiness. What'll boost happiness? I mean, taverns are making everyone happy, but we don't need more taverns, quite frankly, so. Mm, maybe an iron mine. That won't, that won't make them happy, but it'll at least boost our nation to a point where maybe I can start to make new things that'll make them happy. Boom, iron mine. It doesn't even seem that expensive, so that's good. 62 tax... Er, 62, no. 15% tax rate. How high could I have put it? 30. No, no. 62, you know, I can deal with 62. Um, industry, industry, industry. I think we need to begin a large, well, I don't know cardinal direction in this sense right now, but we'll just say this is west, a large westward expansion. What is up with him? Not staffed, I see. Well, that would be an issue, wouldn't it? A swineherd? Oh, there's no employees here. What's causing that? Oh, the immense need for timber workers, I see. Well, that need is going to get bigger now because um, I'm needing more wood. How unexpected. <laughs> How's food supplies looking? In theory, we should be netting again, but only time will really show us whether or not that's true. Oh, the little piggies. Let's go. Alright, our village is looking nice. Well, let's see. We're going to make this a 20-minute video, so we'll be wrapping it up shortly. Five new people moving in. This is going great for us. Job priority. We don't need that many farmers, so yeah, that's fine. Um, maybe one last fisherman so we can get some people in the pig industry. Pork, pig, whatever you want to say. Oh, another manor? This should, uh, like, skyrocket our tax value for the region because, well, that's what it says it does. Alright. Or am I not reading this word? Yields more tax revenue, yeah. So we're we're making wood, but we're using a lot of it as well. So I might be in a spot where I need to make more charcoal. I mean, I have enough. So next dragon attack in seven years. Well, we should be ready by then. Foresters, we need. Is the stockpile does not compl Wait, what? Oh, there's a stockpile. Maybe a resource wagon. How's integrity looking? Good. I figured it'd be such, but you know, I need miners right now. Wait, wait. <laughs> wait, I might have said that a little, a little wrong. Um, you know what I'm saying. Don't take it the wrong way, people. A lot of 
still sad people. Oh, Chamber of War Hall Diplomacy. Or could I possibly build? Um, that dock. Okay, I think I'm gonna build my dock right here. I mean, it's kind of well integrated with our society then, to the point where it's easy enough to just get it right then there. I, I assume the dock does not employ anyone, right? That'd be a little silly if it required workers. Because then it'd be in a pretty bad spot. People are still pretty sad. But I cannot bring down the taxes. I need them. Yeah, maybe maybe we'll make it... I'll push the video a little longer. Because, I mean, long videos are no problem. Exploration ship. That sounds good. We'll begin to chart out a new land, and then I'll begin to make this harbor more secure for the people. What do they think? Hmm. Well, that seems like a bit of an issue, not being able to store our harvest. And that's on fire either, or... Oh, it needs full staff, really? Fine, then. Do me like that. Do me dirty like that. Oh, no one wants to move in. You know what? It's fine. When I build an exploration ship, then I can begin to expand. This island right here will make a fine place to expand to. Well, this is going well. They're walking on water. Impressive. No, it does need workers? No. I need people to move in. Tax rates can go lower. Fine. If it'll make you move in, taxes can go lower. I mean, people are in well good health. I mean, uh I need gold to make a lot of stuff. It's fine. Whatever. We've got a lot of good fertile land. I mean, we're doing pretty good, I think. What is this? Fresh water. Hmm. Well, that's deep water. Oh, who's this? A merchant ship? Uh, okay then. I want this island. Oh, I swear to God, if they've claimed my island. Oh, what does the merchant want? I don't have a lot of stuff, so... Oh, the exploration ship is getting ready. Three more wood. Oh, this is might be it. This might be it right here. Come on. Oh, there we go. Let's sail to this little island right here. Go out. I believe in you. I want to establish a new settlement, so. I'm going to build the settlement right here. Right in the midst of this good, safe land. 
Oh, and I got people on it too. I've discovered a new land. Awesome. Well, I think that's going to be it for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I'll show them make another one. Oh, sorry for that. Uh, if you guys want to see anything else, make sure to like, subscribe, give me some suggestions. Oh, slur. I can't speak right. Suggestions on wh where to go. So, yeah, other than that, uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Have a great day, and goodbye.